so this is kind of a weight change yet again. Um, and it's, it's all for the better. Hopefully there will no, um, be no more changes unless it's, you know, my weight decreasing. So after probably this video, um, it'll be more of like weight loss, um, my progress and how I'm enjoying these programs and how they're working for me, but not actual changes. However, today I made a really big step. Um, we were on the way to a Japanese steakhouse, and I kind of took a detour because as we were leaving, I was trying on um, like a sweater, and it was one that had been loose last year. It was my favorite sweater, so I'd kept it. Um, and I usually don't really keep clothes for some reason, more than one season, um, which he kind of thinks I'm completely weird for, but I'm getting better about, like, actually packing away clothes and that type of thing and reusing them. Thank you. <laughs> because I know it is expensive to get a complete new wardrobe every season, um, and it's not really necessary, and all of that jazz. But it was really tight, and it surprised me. So, on the way to go eat, I was thinking about that, and then I remembered I had seen a Weight Watchers, um, and I, I didn't tell him where we were going, because he had let me pick dinner, and I was, I was driving, and it was going to be a surprise. So I figured if I did chicken out... Uh, it was a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> um, I figured if I did chicken out, there was an Italian place downstairs, um, and we would just go eat Italian, and he would never have to know. However, I got there... And it was open, which I was really surprised about because the Weight Watchers, I'm not sure if that's how it is everywhere, but where we live at least, um, they're only open certain hours every day. And I had done Weight Watchers a while back. Um, and very recently, like I'm, I'm still enrolled online until the end of this month, um, but I, I knew they were only open certain hours. And because it was so spur of the moment, I really wasn't even expecting them to be open. But they were, and it just happened to be, we got there 30 minutes before a meeting was starting, so I got to weigh in, I got to sign up, um, I signed up for a 17-week program, which was $209, which is a little over $12 a week, I believe, um, and yeah, we'll be doing that, I'll be doing that for the next 17 weeks. I'll be there, too. Moral support. Yeah. Because he, he doesn't really want to leave. And I already want a um, thing of oatmeal. So, who knows what it might be next time. <laughs> Moral support gets you things. <laughs> yeah, I'll g we'll go over that in a minute. Um, but I did not know exactly how much I weighed. I knew I gained weight. Um... I did not know I had gained near as much weight um, as I had because when they gave me my weight, I was in complete shock. Um, I think a big part of it is, uh, imagine this is a scale. I know it's going to take a lot of imagination. But if you're standing here on the scale at my doctor's, you can't actually see what you weigh because the way their scale is. It's on a digital screen back here. That way the nurse or NA or PA or doctor or whoever is weighing you, they can see, but um, they do that that way other patients can't see what you weigh. Um, I knew I had gained a bit of weight um, while we were in New York once this summer. Um, but it was worth it. Yeah. At least in terms of the taste it was. It was delicious. Um, I had gained about 30 pounds while we were up there. We were probably up there uh, four to six weeks. Somewhere in there. Closer to four. I yeah. Three, four, something like that. Yeah. Well, at least four. Better part of a month. At least a month. Whatever. Yeah. It was a while. We enjoyed it. Our taste buds enjoyed it. Our stomachs enjoyed it. Yeah. I thought it China Town, Little Italy. 
And the worst Damn part it. was they had street fairs going on for Little Italy and Chinatown while we were there. So, literally the only exercise we got in New York was when we were going to eat. And if anyone has ever been to New York, you know what I'm talking about. Street vendors um, have surprisingly amazing food. We would be walking to go eat, and we'd stop at a street vendor and be, like, eating on our way to go eat. And it was, we were eating, like, 24-7. It was ridiculous, but it was amazing. And oh, we were getting a bit of exercise in there. Yeah, we went to Central Park and things like that. Um, and <laughs> we were very intimate during that time also. I'm not actually sure why, but yeah. So, I, I don't know if sex is technically exercise, but if it is... It gets your heart rate up, I count as exercise. Yeah, sex exercise? I've actually heard of that. Anyway, um... Part of our weight loss plan. <laughs> I weigh 280 pounds, which is 80 pounds more than I thought I weighed. I have no idea. Obviously, I I have an idea. Um, food causes it. Taking a semester off definitely didn't help because I literally sat here and ate um, like 24-7. And I don't know. It's just... I've just gotten so unhealthy. Our eating habits are horrible. We eat out, um, you know, we're out a good bit, so we do eat out um, more than I would like to admit, and that type of thing. So, I always had, like, a mini breakdown of almost in tears when I got my weight. But I was so glad I knew. Um, and afterwards, I called my doctor um, to get my weight history to see if I've been steadily gaining weight, um, or what's been happening, because I, I don't ask my doctor about my weight, because the scale and I are not friends, let's just say that. Um, but yeah, and surprisingly, it's actually been happening over the last few years. Um, pretty much after every miscarriage, I've gained around 20 pounds um, in the two or three months following. And then, um, in New York, I gained around 30. So, about 90 pounds. So, that would <laughs> account for the weight I've gained. And I, I did not realize I had gained that much. I'm sorry, I'm moving around my foot to sleep. Um, but yeah, I just, it completely threw me by surprise. So, we will definitely not be TTCing in April like we had hoped. Um, the program does not stop until May, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to do two 17 weeks worth. Um, I'm not sure if I've mentioned how much it is. It's... 209 $209. That's a bit over $12 a week. I think that's completely worth it for me to get healthy, um, to get a baby. Um, because the place I'm going to be giving birth at once we do get pregnant, you, you cannot be over... 190 pounds um, when in labor. So my goal is around 160, 150, um, which is uh, 120 pounds to lose. So it's going to take me a while. And we're not on birth control. We're not not trying to have a baby or any of that. Um, we do BD. It's not for TTC. We do it because you are my wife. You are pretty. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Need I say more? Man reason. Um. But yeah, so. Uh, not man reasons. Hubby reasons. Yeah, hubby reasons. But, um, so yeah, it's probably going to be like August before we TTC. Um, and maybe before, maybe after, give or take. But I'm just excited to be in Weight Watchers. Um, in combination with Weight Watchers, Ally, personal trainer, we're going to start using the gym. 
where we live has an entire equip gym, um, as if you were walking in Gold's gym. Like, it's, it's got everything. We just, we've never used it, um, but we are going to start using it. It's open 24-7, so that's cool. Where is this? It even has a movie theater. Did you know that? Yeah. Yeah, I noticed that earlier today, and I, I'm not sure I completely blank my mind. We need to go there. Cheap date night. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it has all these amazing things that we've not been using, so we're canceling his gym membership, and um, I was going to get one, so we're just going to start working out here. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. While I was at Weight Watchers, I did get a few things um, food-related. I got this creamy chocolate smoothie shake. Um, and I asked about a juicer because I was planning on getting one. However, Weight Watchers is not fond of juicers, apparently. Um, they said it creates a lot of sugar and things like that, and the pulp is actually where a lot of your nutrients are, and you could be using, basically how she explained it was, you could be, is the cat hurting you? <laughs> you could be um, drinking a lot more, like, sugars and calories and that type of thing than you realize. Um, so what a lot of people do is they just blend this with um, soy milk and fresh vegetables and things like that. And that's like an amazing breakfast. So I got two boxes of that. This is two weeks for the breakfast. Um, I'll probably make some of my lunch. I got this lemon mousse pie bar. Um. <laughs> oh, different mousse. <laughs> We're so silly today. Um, because that's what you're married. Everyone was raving about these things, and I love lemon and mousses, so. Mousse. So I, I just had to get these. Um, Hubby won a thing of oatmeal. <laughs> he was so excited to win it. And then I also got... That's what you get for providing moral support. Yeah. <laughs> you win oatmeal. I got two things of strawberry fruit. Um, and Weight Watchers has had these forever. I did Weight Watchers like four years ago. Probably five. And they had these then. Um, so they're amazing. And basically what it is, a lot of people don't like them. I love them because they're so chewy. You literally suck on them. They take forever. And they're tiny. And eight of these is one point. So they're basically like no points. Um, because I only eat one or two. I mean, they last forever in your mouth. Um, and your jaw, if you do try and chew them, your jaw gets sore, so then I don't eat more. Um, so I got that, and then we went to Harris Teeter and got, you don't have to get Weight Watchers brand snacks. Um, if you're doing Weight Watchers, you can do, you know, anything pretty much in moderation. And I got the chocolate chip cookie one. Well, that stuff was... A good deal to start with, and it was two for one, so. Yeah, let's probably get one free. Carrot cream cake, a chocolate cream cake, and then lemon cream cake. Do I see a trend? I like cream cake. <laughs> um, That's the trend, I think. But I've actually had one of each of the cream cakes, and they really are good. So, yeah, we're doing Weight Watchers. That's kind of... You know, in conjunction with Ally, and Ally is going amazing so far. It's definitely been reminding me um, when I do eat something that is not healthy. Ah, uh, yes, the donuts and popcorn. Yeah, I had a donut craving um, while I was on my period, and Ally very quickly reminded me donuts are not healthy. And popcorn, let's just say movie theater popcorn, Ally hates. It was like, it really... My stomach literally felt so uncomfortable. I was so crampy within, like, minutes of eating the popcorn. I may never eat popcorn again after that. Um, but, yeah, I got all my books. Um, I'm excited. 
Sorry, my voice goes up when I'm happy. But, yeah. We'll and you're gonna make it. You're gonna be successful. Yeah, I'm really worried. I'll be right here with you the whole time. I was really. <laughs> yes. Um, I was really worried that I'm not gonna stick with it, but hopefully by making these vlogs and hobby and um, all of that, we can be here. And with all these meetings, and that's just in the one location. Uh, we live in a big city, so I think there's like four or five um, within like a 10, 15 minute radius. Um, <laughs> but between all these meetings and that type of thing, we should definitely be able to do this. And um, yeah, we'll, we may get pregnant between now and then. Um, um, you will probably get pregnant. I don't think I'd be getting pregnant. Um, very true. But, yeah, so we'll just kind of have to wait. I'll to help, see. but you'll be the one getting pregnant. <laughs> the cat is eating the hemostats. Oh, my yeah. life is amazing. She won't get too far. <laughs> um, but, yeah, that is... Yeah, give her some iron. That is kind of our... Or aluminum or whatever it is. Uh, I think it's because they still. Um, okay. But... We will be trying again probably August, September. Hopefully I'll meet my weight loss goal by then. Um, I'll be having weigh-ins for cops. you oh, guys. Our cat's trying to steal. Both are bored today. Um, yep, that's me. <sighs> and for some odd reason, you married me. I weigh two hundred and eighty four point four pounds as of today and today is January eighth, twenty thirteen. So I got my booklet. Ooh, let me not show you that number. Um and yeah, well this is a weight record, so it has the seventeen weeks in here. And every time it weigh in, I'll do that. So I will be doing weigh ins now with you guys, which is kind of terrifying, but should motivate me even more. Um, and yeah, this is kind of a weird, long, rambly, us being us video. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions or anything like that, feel free to ask. And, and anything having to do with me being me, yeah, that's going to be weird. <laughs> um, feel free to ask. I will update you guys and tell you how everything's going each week. Um, but yeah, that's it. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> you want to say bye? Bye.